Hello everyone. I hope you are all doing great. I'm Manhar and welcome back to MSFT webcast. In today's video, we are going to learn the steps on how guest users can sign in through a common endpoint in Microsoft Entra ID. In the previous two videos, we explored various methods for inviting and creating guest user accounts in Microsoft Entra ID. We created one guest account through the Microsoft Entra Admin Center and another using the My Groups Access Panel. We added one guest user with a Microsoft account and another with a Gmail account. The question now is how guest users can access the My Apps portal using their email address. Let's take a look at that. First, let me show you the existing guest user accounts in our Microsoft Entra IT tenant. Access and log into the Microsoft Entra Admin Center. You can access Microsoft Entra Admin Center using the URL entra.microsoft.com. Just a reminder, we are using the Microsoft Entra ID free subscription. Expand Users and click on All Users. Let me apply a filter to show only the guest users on this page. Click on Add Filter. From the list, select User Type Filter. Keep the equal operator selected. From value, choose guest and click apply. As we can see, we have two guest users in our tenant. The guest user account with display name Ajay Patel is created using the Microsoft account. And the guest user account with display name John Cena is created using the Gmail account. Let me show you how guest user with the Microsoft account can access the My Apps portal. Open new in private window. Type URL myapps.microsoft.com and hit enter key. And the guest uses email address. In our case, it will be ajaypatel88 at outlook.com. Click next. Enter user's password and click on sign in. After successful authentication, user will reach on my apps portal. Since we haven't assigned any apps to this guest user, they will see the message there are no apps to show. So this is how guest users with Microsoft account can access My Apps Portal. Let's sign out from My Apps Portal. Now let's attempt to access the My Apps Portal using the guest user account with Gmail. And a guest user's email address. In our case, the Gmail address of our guest user is indian.training03 at gmail.com. Click Next. We will receive an error message stating we couldn't find an account with that username. Try another or get a new Microsoft account. Even though a guest user with this email address exists in our tenant, they won't be able to sign in using their Gmail account. This happens when the guest account is created through an external non-Microsoft directory such as Gmail or Yahoo and not with Microsoft Entra ID or a Microsoft account. Hence, you can only use your personal email address for sign-in and not the Microsoft Entra ID UPN. You will receive a passcode on that email for authentication. A password will not be set or required for sign-in here. This feature is called Email One-Time Passcode Authentication for B2B Guest User. The Email One-Time Passcode feature is a way to authenticate B2B collaboration users when they can't be authenticated through other means such as Microsoft Entra ID, Microsoft Account or Social Identity Providers. When a B2B guest user tries to redeem your invitation or sign in to your shared resources, they can request a temporary passcode which is sent to their email address. Then they enter this passcode to complete the authentication. Let's take a look at the steps. To sign in, guest users must use a common endpoint for login to Microsoft Entra ID. Click on the Sign In Options link at the bottom of the page. Then choose Sign In to an organization. Then type the Microsoft Entra tenant's custom or initial domain name. For us, type msftwebcast.in and click Next. After clicking Next, the usual sign in page will appear. Now you have to use your personal email address as it is. Select Use another account to specify the guest user's Gmail address. Here, type guest user's personal Gmail address. Let me enter indian.training03 at gmail.com. 
click next. A passcode is sent to the user's email address. To complete the authentication, the guest user needs to retrieve the passcode from their email and enter it in the browser window. I have already accessed the user's Gmail mailbox. Let's open the mail from MSFT webcast. Let's copy the verification code. Let's go back to in private window. Paste the copied code and click on sign in. The guest user is now authenticated and they can see the shared resources in my apps portal. This is how the guest user with Gmail account can access my apps portal. You can also skip this whole process. Just use the link provided in your invite email to access my apps portal. Let me show you that method as well. Go back to user's Gmail mailbox. Click on inbox. Open the invitation mail. This is the mail which we are talking about. Here we have the invitation link. To access my apps portal, user just need to click on accept invitation link. This will directly take guest user to my apps portal login page. Click on send code. Once more, enter the verification code to complete the authentication and access the my apps portal. Go back to Gmail. Uh, let's copy the verification code. Paste the code and click on sign in. As you can see, user has successfully accessed my apps portal. That's it for today's video. I hope you found this video useful and informative. If you have any questions or need further clarification on any of these steps, please leave a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos on Microsoft Entra ID and other Microsoft related topics. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.